Dr. Brandon Hall is running for the Belton School Board. Yes. Would you I'm like to come? I'm not a doctor, but I'll take it. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a doctor. I it's okay. You, I thought you had that title as a minister. You're not. No, I don't. I don't get that title, but I'll take it. You know. I mean, if Dr. Dre can do it, so can I, right? I mean, if, yeah, if a rapper can be a doctor, I, you know, so Brandon. can so can someone else. <laughs> I do appreciate the, you know, the, the, the respect. Forgive me for that. Message. Absolutely, I was just having fun with it, but no, absolutely. Um, I know it's a, but I want to make the record clear: I am not a doctor, and I do not play one on TV, and I did not stay at a Holiday Inn Express last night. So I am not qualified in any way. Um, although I have cleared up a bunch of accidents at the house, raising a number of kids, and still raising kids. But uh, getting into my two minutes. Uh, I'm Brandon Hall, and I'm running for the Belton School Board. I don't know who here is from Belton. Is anyone here in Belton? Great. Oh, awesome. That's quite a few. And those of you that aren't, you know people in Belton. Absolutely. What we need, this is absolutely completely grassroots. And if you think that Belton is immune from all of the uh, ordeals that you hear in the national media with things like CRT and library books and discipline and distractions in the schoolroom, you are sadly mistaken. Everything that is happening at the national level in some way is happening in a very similar level at Belton. And unfortunately, a lot of the leadership at Belton is trying to turn the Belton School District into what Austin is doing and what Leander is doing and what Round Rock is doing. And we do not want to do that. We want to keep Belton Belton. Austin can stay weird, but we want to keep Belton Belton. And that is one of the main reasons that I'm running. With only two minutes, I can't go into deep detail about it. but. I am there to stop what is happening and keep the Belton values, the morals, the ethics, the small town feel, even though we are growing, we can still keep that. So I would love your support. I'm running alongside with another individual, Dwayne Gossett, who's running in Area 1. I'm running in Area 5. He and I share the same values and we're running on the same platform. So please support either one of us if you're in Area 1 or 5. And if you're not and you know people in those areas, please tell them to go out and vote. You can go to our website, it's Belton Parents for the number four change. And you can do the Googles or whatever, but it's Belton Parents for Change, and it has all of our information there. I'll leave some uh, business cards that have all of our social media stuff on it. You can go to our Facebook page, like it, share it. We need to get the word out because what's ultimately going to happen is starting Monday, early voting starts. We need people to get out and vote. We need you to vote. You know, that's what's going to that's what's going to win this one person. One vote is a very, very strong thing. And we need more people to vote for Belton ideals and Belton values than for Austin ideals and Austin values. Thank you.